Okay, um, instead of progressing, we just rang the second bell, let's backtrack a little bit, uh, into that cave. And then get your sword out. Um, and on your left, right there against that wall. No, go back there. You go. No, no, go to the wall. That area, hit it. Yeah. Oh, hello. It'd be a hidden wall. Okay, you're gonna talk to this guy. You're not gonna fight him. You want to say yes. This is sort of like, are you a god? Yeah. <laughs> Audrey Hepburn? All right, cool. So if you're yes and he just wallows out of your way, he also becomes a vendor that will sell you things. Well, okay. Um, I think this bonfire might kindle you more, actually. No, it's, it's to 10. Okay. Um, because if you look to your right there, uh, there's a firekeeper of sorts. All right, you can't talk to her, um, but she's a covenant keeper, and um, and a fire keeper. So I don't. If we had a fire keeper soul, um, she could reinforce the flask. Um, you can go ahead and enter the covenant if you want. You need to wear um, that witch's ring that you chose in the beginning. Remember, I told you it allows you to talk with one NPC in the game. Yeah. It's her. Oh, well. So she'll tell you the backstory that that was her, um, sister. Okay? And basically what's going on, I don't think she knows the full picture. I don't think she knows that her sisters pretty much went insane. Um, just the worshipping dudes, shit out of her? She, her sister, um, would, would you check it out? Oh, the witch's ring? Oh, I don't think you have it. Oh, okay, cool. Yeah. That was, that was a gift that you would have picked at the beginning of the game. Oh, okay. So, and then she would tell you that um, uh, her sister basically set up these little egg worshipping guys. Yeah. Um, they're feeding her humanity and keeping her from going in insane. Um, and so if you feed her 30 humanity, like after 10, she'll give you another pyromancy spell or something. Yeah. And at 30, she's going to open up a shortcut um, for a bit in that fire zone that we need open. To kill a creature that, if Solaire encounters, will drive him insane. Okay. And then it's a sad time for Solaire. Um, she's all that's back there. Um, at the moment, I don't recommend we start popping the humanity uh, and and turning it in. Let's just take a look and do. We the have. We've got eight. Nine. We have nine, so we couldn't even get ten to get up to. Uh, the next tier. Uh, you can talk to dude. I forget what he sells. I know he becomes a merchant. Um, you got the no, menu. Uh, the... Are you prepared to dedicate yourself to our fair lady? Then I will make available whatever you require. If you need something, ask me first. Only one more humanity. No? Okay. Oh, so he gives you a list of, um, you could buy, there's no point in buying it. Um, modify equipment. Oh, he can reinforce your pyromancy flame. Eh. But we've stopped using pyromancy, yeah. so. Um, alright, well, I guess it's gonna be it then, for here. Um, but most important thing is we lit and we rest at that bonfire. Um, okay, do you want to go back to Blight Town and... Go on a guided tour for loot. Uh, I guess so. May as well. We will pick up a couple of humanities along the way. There, there are a couple of humanities in here. I'm not gonna guide those, guide you to those necessarily. Um. We can off camera at some point. Even I can do it while you're not here. Go. 
uh, those rats in the sewer. Yeah. They occasionally drop a humanity. Oh yeah. And yeah, I've done that yeah. run so many times. You can like, there's a run where you can kill like seven or eight rats and then go to the bonfire and reset them. So it may take like thirty minutes, but you you end up getting the number you need. So when we come out at the top here, I don't think the boulder dudes are going to be chucking at you yet. Alright, so plan A. Oh, let's get out to the light changes so we can see down. Okay. There's. Oh, you can see the item. Straight ahead there. That should be a large Titanite shard. Cool. Upgrade material. So, plan A is to run, grab that, and then run back to your other bonfire and rest. On the other side here. Yeah, so just run straight. Just, just run, pick it up, and then find the cave again that's on your left. At this point, I mean, I'm going to recommend that just running past and grabbing is is the answer to everything. Okay, yeah, as you come up on the left should be your uh, bonfire. Uh, nope, maybe you haven't gone far enough. Torch. It's going to be past that. Yeah. Those torches mark the path back up. Okay, as you come out, book it straight across. And then go to the left of this wall and follow it around. Hug the wall and you should find a pyromancy mist spell. Oh, you're not hugging the wall. Okay, around behind you. That wall, hug it, keep going to the left. There it is. There we go. All right. Um, cool. There's some stuff. Wait. Okay. That's not the wall that I thought it was. Stuff. So if you follow that wall back out, or if you go back out to the entrance, yeah. Go to your left. Yeah. Go inside this area. You turn left. Turn left. Wait. 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 Okay. You're. Yeah. Stay against the wall. Follow it around. That direction. Okay, you have to go around that pillar. What's this map is just wrong. Because now you're back out. No, yeah. don't go down there. There's a dude throwing a rock. Yeah. This map is wrong. Okay. Well, Who I cares? may have grabbed it earlier. Cause Maybe. I, yeah, because I think I saw something down this way and just. I was like, oh, fuck it, I'm gonna He's gonna that. pick it up. Okay, cool. Alright, so, yeah. Uh, straight across. I don't need to go down any of these little cubby holes. Um, and... Let's see, where are you coming up at? Okay, you're coming up the second bridge. Just stay in this and head straight. You see, okay, there you go. You see that ramp? Yeah. Go up that ramp. All right, get this. Hit the wall. There it is. And now go behind the wall, go behind the chest, and hit the wall again. Um, you know what? Hmm. This is a later moment. This is, we do this later, actually. Yeah. Okay. There's not a bonfire in there, and that's a whole nother zone that leads to a whole nother zone. And, then, and if I remember right, there's no bonfire in the first zone. Alright, um... As you walk down, look to your left. Okay, that's a green titanite shard down there. Cool. There are sluggies down there. Jump down there, or...? Oh. You might be able to with a full thing. Uh, but you might be able to lock onto a slugger and do a, uh, a plunging attack on him as well. I would, est I would top off before jumping, because you're at right. half health. Right. Um... 
see if you can lock onto him or at least drop in an area where you can yeah, there you go. go. Nice. You can grab that. Nice. That's an upgrade. Green is what we needed for our uh thing. Hey. Okay. Yeah, don't just don't stand in front of those guys and you're fine. Go um cross the cross the lake. Turn left. Hard left. Okay, run all the way up against the other wall there. Um, and follow it to the left. Yeah. Okay, that light up in the back, that's a large Titanite shard. Cool. Um, there's another item back here that is a large weapon that probably not going to be useful to you. It's that in the back. There's a lot of slugs around it, so be ready to get the fuck out. All right. Like, can you just imagine the hell of this level? Yeah. Hard, hard, hard pass. I mean, that's there's bits where it's slowing down anyway. Oh, I think that's because you're running out of stamina. No, I mean like the frame rate. Oh, oh yes. Yeah, it's 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 not perfect even on a high end PC. Yeah, like right there. Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Um, I think we're good down here. To the, on the other side, yeah. Cross back. We're not going up the ramp. Go to the left. Okay. This is the middle. Go to the left, and you're looking for a, a set of um, woodwork going back up. Here it is. We might have some interesting times here. Keep going up. We might have to kill some of these guys. It might be easier just to kill than... Oh, oh shit, we're getting toxic from where? Oh, there's a little fucker throwing a... Is that what P1 means on the map? I guess. The P, poison arrow attack. Okay, well, I know that's that. Okay, so as you come out of your bonfire... Yep. Go left, and just hug the wall. There it is. Oh, you can see your, uh, echoes. Not oh. echoes. Souls. Right. Wrong game. Alright, let's just go ahead and kill everybody. Yeah. That's a fucking asshole. Yeah. yeah. Now, um, getting on the platform oh a bit God. may eliminate you from having to deal with all the big guys. Um, the mosquitoes might be able to come up, but... Okay, so just stab, 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 and get rid of him. And then get up there and that toxic motherfucker. Uh, now see, you're, you're heal, heal. Yeah. Toxing is much faster. There we go. Right. Oh god, there's two of them. Oh fuck. fuck. Well. I'm gonna die from the toxin. Yep. Alright, well you got an idea where you're heading. And I think if I'm reading the map correctly, he was right behind those two. Okay. Well, here's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna just go ahead and take out all the low windows first. Yeah. Like we were doing before. I'm not gonna blame you. Because the big dude's honestly not that big of a deal. No, they are slow. It's just... You know, none of them are a big deal. It's just the number of them. These dudes are tough to hit with melee weapons. So I'd rather just go ahead and... Pick them out. So yeah, um, that poison guy is blocking um, the Wanderer set. So we'll have another set to check out. Um, the Tattered set, I believe... 
is the starting pyromancer set. Um, I want to say the wandering set is another lightweight set of armor. And the falcon, and then behind him, um, we should be able to get to some spells and, uh... The Crimson set. The bonds. We'll have lots of fashion soul options to pick from that won't impact your run speed or roll. Which is why I'm not blowing off this whole area. Actually has a couple of new He takes a shit ton more damage with that R2. I don't know if you noticed. I did not. I bet it's because your R2 counts as a thrust. Uh, and they're weak to pokes. Piercing, yeah, that would make sense. Okay, you ain't kidding. I'm more worried right now just not getting in the aggro range of the toxin guy. Did you play any Bloodborne? Uh, not today, I haven't. Oh, okay. Like, uh, I kind of I just wanted to, you know, at least maintain some purity this run, and yeah, maybe, you know, in the next week I'll kind of... Yeah, I, I loaned uh, John a copy of Bloodborne just because I, I kind of felt like He's only doing this, you know, uh, once a week or so, and kind of has to, like, spend a bit of the first couple episodes getting back into combat, but doing all right. Okay. I don't know if you're going to be able to lock onto him. Yeah. Your you thing is going to be just close speed fast. Yeah. Because I don't know that you can even survive um, the full, a full bar of toxin, like, we got a lot of Sunny D, but... Right. Shit. We're gonna make it the ladder. Yeah, I thought better of it. <laughs> like, oh yeah, this... this uh... We're gonna top off and then kill two. Yep. All right, little fucker. All right, cool. All right, see if we can kill this guy. All right, where is it? Where you go? Here's the item. Take it. Okay, we got the set. Yeah. <laughs> the Edge Lord set. I'm just looking at it. I'm like, that's now. I'm just like, that's that sets the total Edge Lord. Um, where the hell is he? Oh, there he is. See him in the distance there down the, down the oh, path? Oh, yeah, there he is. All right, oh, Esther. Esther. All right. Just run and close that distance. One hit! That's not wow. bad. Um, I was expecting that to, like... Now, unfortunately, I don't think purple moss cures toxin, so I wouldn't use it. Right. Um, I guess... Pick where you want to die? <laughs> yeah, I want to at least somewhere where it's easy for me to get back to my soul. This is not that place? Okay, this is that place? Yeah, see, I, yeah. I kind of figured I could do a little bit of a... Oh, fuck. You, maybe you can just rest. Yeah. All right. Good job by me. <laughs> All right, and we pick it up. More uh, Blighttown Express.